नमस्ते वेलकम टू द नेक्स्ट वीडियो ऑफ मशीन लर्निंग प्रैक्टिस कोर्स इन दिस वीडियो विल डिस्कस अबाउट बैगिंग एंड बूस्टिंग विल बी रिकॉर्डिंग दिस स्लाइड डेक इन थ्री पार्ट्स इन द फर्स्ट पार्ट विल रिकॉर्ड वोटिंग बैगिंग एंड रैंडम फॉरेस्ट इन द सेकेंड पार्ट विल रिकॉर्ड बूस्टिंग एंड ग्रेडियंट बूस्टिंग एंड इन द थर्ड पार्ट विल विल रिकॉर्ड द एक्जी बूस्ट फंक्शनलिटी इन एस के लर्न Let's first discuss about voting estimators. There are two voting estimators, voting classifier and voting regressor. They are implemented as part of sklearn.ensemble module. Both these estimators take the following common parameters: base estimator and weights. And they implement the following functions: fit, predict, fit_transform and score. Fit is used to train the estimators predict is used to obtain the prediction for new samples fit underscore transform performs transformation as well as the fitment and the score is used to obtain the performance of the estimator voting classifier takes an additional argument which is voting and there are two types of voting either a hard voting or a soft voting then there are bagging estimators two bagging estimators again bagging classifier and bagging regressor they are also implemented as part of sklearn.ensemble module they take the following common parameters base estimator by default it is none in case of classification we use decision tree classifier as the default base estimator whereas in case of bagging regressor we use decision tree regressor as a default base estimator default number of number of estimators is 10 max sample can be integer or float whenever it is integer we take those many samples and when it is float we basically multiply the max sample with the total number of samples and take the resulting samples as the max sample for sampling max feature is also either an integer or float and if it is integer we select those many features and if it is float then we select number of features equal to the total number of features into max features bootstrap is true by default and it specifies whether samples are drawn with replacement bootstrap underscore features and ob underscore score both of them are false by default and bootstrap underscore features denotes or indicates whether features are drawn with replacement and ob score denotes whether to use out of bag samples to estimate generalization error or test error then we have random forest estimators again two estimators one for classification and second for regression random forest classifier and random forest regressor respectively they are also implemented as part of sklearn.ensemble module the parameters of random forest can be classified as decision tree parameters and bagging parameters let's first look at bagging parameters the number of trees are specified by n estimators default number of trees used for classification is 10 whereas default number of trees used for regression are 100 then we have bootstrap flag that specifies whether to use bootstrap samples for training when when it is true bootstrap samples are used and when bootstrap is false whole data set is used for training the estimators ob_score specifies whether to use out of bag samples for estimating generalization error it is only available when bootstrap is equal to true then max_score samples specifies the number of samples to be drawn while bootstrapping if it is if it is specified as none we use all samples in the training data if it is specified as integer then we use max sample samples from training data if it is float we use max samples into total number of samples from the training data if it is float the value should always between 0 and 1 and random underscore state controls randomness of features and samples selected during bootstrap the number of features to be considered while splitting the decision tree is specified by max feature 
there could be there could be five different values either auto square root log 2 integer and float whenever we specify an integer value we use the max feature as the value specified in the in the parameter if it is float then the total number of features used are value into total number of features if it is auto then we use square root of number of features if it is square root sqrt we use square root of number of features while split, making the splitting decision if it is log 2 we take number of features log of number of features to the base 2 and if it is none then we take all the features for deciding on the split in the decision tree let's look at some of the decision tree parameters we have the criteria for splitting the node and it is specified through criterion default for classification is guinea and default for regression is squared error the depth of the tree is controlled by max underscore depth parameter the default value is none which means the tree will be grown until all leaf nodes are pure or until leaves contain less than min underscore samples underscore splits samples we will continue to split the internal node until they contain min underscore samples underscore split samples whenever it is specified as an integer then it is considered as a number and whenever it is specified as a float then the min sample splits is calculated as the min sample splits into total number of samples the tree growth can be controlled by mean underscore impurity underscore decrease parameter a node will be split if it reduces impurity at least by the value specified in this parameter the complexity of the tree can also be controlled by ccp underscore alpha parameter through minimal cost complexity pruning procedure so ccp underscore alpha is a parameter used in minimal cost complexity pruning estimator underscore member variable contains a collection of fitted estimators feature underscore importances underscore member variable contains a list of important features we use fit method for building forest of trees from training data with the specified parameters decision underscore path returns decision path in the forest predict returns class label in classification and outputs a value in regression and predict underscore proba and predict underscore log underscore proba are functions available in classification and they return probabilities and the log of probabilities in this video we studied a skill and functionality for voting bagging and random forest we looked at how to set up classification and regression with voting bagging and random forest